Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 10 is Mick Amarari, Tjapaltjari. He was born in the western desert of Alice Springs in 1926 in a nomadic family. He moved to a camp near Puteri Springs after losing his family to a terrible tragedy. Mick later started to paint while he was part of the Papaya Council where he received much needed encouragement from an advisor Jorf Bardo to paint. He showed keen interest in painting and soon his subtle yet powerful paintings were staged at an early exhibition of Central Desert Paintings at SYDs in Taylor Square, Australia. The main stories like Kangaroo, Dingo, Water, Wild Bandicoot, Moon Dreamings and many more were explored by Mick during his magnificent career. His artwork had a contemporary edge and intrinsic traditional value that set him apart from others. He had a wider influence that went beyond his community and he managed to strike an emotional chord through his paintings. Tjapaltjari received several accolades like National Aboriginal Art Award for his pioneering work. Mick came at number 10 in the list of most popular indigenous artists. Top 10 most popular indigenous artists in the world, rank number 9 is Barbara Weir Barbara Weir one of the most famous native artist, was born in the Utopian region at Bundy River Station in 1945. She is considered as one of most well-known and respected Aboriginal women artists. Barbara Weir has captured the attention of the audience around the world with her compelling abstract canvases that reflect great depth and subtle movements. She portrays an elusive story of her life through an exquisite expression. Weir went through personal tragedy and tribulations at a young age that helped her to explore her artistic talents through her paintings. She has been considered as a prolific artist who is efficacious and skilled in indigenous dot work, linear designs and use of texture. The intricate details in her artwork reflect broad range of patterning and mediums used to experiment and push the boundaries. She was versatile in her approach and identified herself as a passionate member of indigenous utopian community which is also reflected in her artwork. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 8 is Minipool Minipool was born in Oliawara Land in Alice Springs. The artwork of Minnie reflected Oli community ceremonies and cultural nuances that captured the attention of art lovers around the world. The bold use of free-flowing lines and colors were evident in her work. She was one of the most influential local artists in the world who depicted the ceremonial body paint designs and underlying thought processes of the ethnic group. Pool has also been considered as an influential artist who encouraged other women artists of indigenous community to paint and leave a profound impact on the contemporary art scene. She has been considered as one of the top contemporary indigenous artists in Australia and popular for her depiction of her subjects in a modern yet traditional style. Pool won several accolades like 19th Tesselstra National Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Art Award. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 7 is Rick Barto. Rick Barto was a Native American artist who is a prolific artist. His artwork has been included in half a dozen museums around the world and his contributions have been featured in books, magazines and group exhibitions. Barto studied at Western Oregon State College in 1969 in secondary art education. He was sent to Vietnam after his graduation from 1969 to 1971. These years were coupled with trials and tribulations. He suffered from a sense of disillusionment. The hardships subsequently led to alcoholism and divorce during the 1970s. He turned to art for catharsis that played a detrimental role in his recovery during this time. He presented his first solo show at the prestigious Jamiso Forward Slash Thomas Gallery. 
He became popular for his distinctive sensibility and attached his signature style to every concept of artwork. Bartow's artwork depicted the American culture through folklore, global myths and his personal experiences that engaged everyone. Rick stays at number 7 in the list of popular indigenous artists. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 6 is Ed Moya Lewis Ed Moya Lewis was a Native American and African American sculptor who lived with her mother's nomadic tribe as an orphan until the age of 12. The elder brother of Lewis financed her early schooling and helped her move to Albany and Ohio in 1859 at Oberlee College. Lewis faced hurdles and trials as a Native American and African American at the college and later in Boston. However she was determined to become a sculptor in spite of minimum training. The beginning of her compelling career began after she moved to Rome by financing her trip through the sale of portrait busts of few leaders and abolitionists. She was a popular ethnic artist because of the portrayal of African American and Native American ancestry in her work. The letter from El Maria Child in the Nationality Slavery Standard had quoted Ed Moyer's love for art. She said, There is nothing so beautiful as the free forest. To catch a fish when you are hungry, cut the boughs of a tree, make a fire to roast it, and eat it in the open air, is the greatest of all luxuries. I would not stay a week pent up in cities, if it were not for my passion for art. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 5 is Aro of Kijeku Aro of Kijeku was born in the small settlement of Kijeku in 1822 as a Greenland Inuit hunter who later became world-renowned painter. Hirich Rink became interested in the compelling work of Aro who strongly reflected Greeladic art and culture. The legend of Aku Isaku who was illustrated in the woodcuts became popular as the classic figure of children's literature in Greenland. The artwork of Aro depicted intricate details of Inuit history and culture through the use of many watercolors. An Arctic archaeologist Igil Kuth brought Aro's work into limelight in 1960. Thus Aro was popularly known as the father of Greenlandic painting and his original artwork is still preserved at the Greenland National Museum in Uak forward slash Godthub. The woodcut illustrations of Aro were published in 1859 and 186 o as Kaladlito Q forward slash he also earned national recognition for the success of his pictorial book which was based on the art culture of Greenland. He also distinguished himself through his comprehensible and coherent narratives as an indigenous writer that set him apart from other popular artists. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 4 is Camilo Egas Camilo Egas gave a new status to the Ecuadorian art by introducing innovative elements, dramatic and declamatory style to the artwork. The paintings are an intriguing amalgamation of European high art tradition and local subject matter of the Ecuadorian identity. Egas was born in 1889 in Quito and acquired a government scholarship for studying in Rome where his defining early work was born. The artwork that reflected indigenous fiestas, dances and everyday life of Andes in a rhetorical style was made popular by him. He has been considered as one of the most important artists of the 20th century who explored life and art in his paintings and reflected his lucid intelligence. He combined the aesthetic sense of costumbrista painting tradition with contemporary art movements of other countries to create dramatic themes. He was also devoted to abstract expressionist art in his artwork and the museum Camilo Egas at Quito has most of his artwork. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World, Rank Number 3 is Kiyojua Kashevak Kiyokyo Kashevak is considered the most renowned Inuit artist. He was born in 1927 on Baffin Island. 
She made notable contributions as an Inuit artist and became the pioneer of modern Inuit art. She has been considered as one of the most acclaimed artists in Canada and internationally remembered for her memorable artwork The Enchanted Owl in 1960. The iconic artwork was commemorated on a Canadian stamp in 1970 as one of the most famous artworks of Canada. She hails from the Arctic regions of Canada and developed her artistic style from embroidery that she learned as a child during 1950s. Canadian government and the Hudson's Bay Company envisaged developing arts and crafts in the village and Keojuak made remarkable contributions to the company. This marked the beginning of her momentous career. She became world-renowned post the release of the film Keojuak that was nominated as the best short documentary at the Academy Award and produced by National Film Board of Canada. The work of Keojuak has been instrumental in introducing the work to the Inuit art. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World Rank number 2 is Emily Kaimpwari While compiling the list of most popular indigenous artists Emily Kaimpwari has some special contributions. She made an essentially noteworthy contribution to contemporary art scene through her prolific paintings. The intricate paintings reflected strong cultural connections, ancestral history and kinship ties of her clan country Alhalkeri. She resonated strongly with the creative power of dreaming as her source of inspiration. Kpwari was born in Utopia which is a remote desert area in Alice Springs. She painted around 3,000 artworks in the span of her eight-year painting career. She became an overnight sensation of national and international stature at the age of 80. Emily became familiar to the material in her art in 1977 when batik making was introduced to utopian women through government-funded education program. The women of batik group were later introduced to canvas and acrylic paint. During this period Emily painted her first canvas Emu Woman which garnered phenomenal attention in Australia and she became the recipient of the prestigious award Australian Artists Creative Fellowship in 1992. She has won several accolades and awards for her compelling artwork. Top 10 Most Popular Indigenous Artists in the World Rank number 1 is Clifford Possum Japaltjari he was born in 1932 in Alice Springs on a creek bed on Nagabai Station. He is considered as one of the most famous Central Western Desert artists to dominate the Aboriginal art scene. He made a significant impact in 1971 and remained inarguably a noteworthy artist even after his death in 2002. Tjapaltjari amalgamated traditional painting with the contemporary artwork which later pioneered the artwork of Central Western Dot Painting. He started his career as a stockman for cattle stations in his ancestral country and later as a construction worker in the Papuya settlement. He was also employed as a wood carver and a skilled painter during the early 1970s. When Japaltjari was employed as one of the painting men along with his brother Lurid Japaltjari, little did he know that his life would change after the establishment of Papuya Tula Artists Group. Queen Elizabeth II was presented with one of the grandiose paintings of Clifford Possum Japaltjari during the late 1970s. The intricate three-dimensional artworks transcended the knowledge of Aboriginal and national history of Amatera. He won some prestigious awards like Alice Springs Art Prize, Order of Australia Award for his contribution to art and indigenous community and many more. Because of his amazing contribution Clifford ranks number one in the list of most popular indigenous artists.